Hey guys, Kyle the Dead Knight of Anime here bringing you the review of My Hero Academia chapter 190. And I'm not gonna lie, this was definitely one of those chapters where you, you, you pretty much all, you, you, you're pretty much all, almost saying to yourself that say fuck the analytical shit because there was just too much craziness and epicness going on going on in this chapter to really even really even get into the analytical shit. And although Although I, I guess in a way you could say that there still is a, 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 definitely an analysis to definitely an analysis to be made here. Like, for instance, um, in and like for instance, okay, let's let's start off by talking about uh, about the entirety of the fight between between High End and Endeavor and, and how it ended basically between between how it ended and between how it started and how it ended because. Between, and, and the thing is, in a lot of ways, the the fight itself was was the fight itself was definitely hyped. There, there's no denying that, but it was the, the I think the, I think what made it hype wasn't necessarily the fact that it was high end and endeavor, but what I think made the fight work and what made the fight so hype is the is the fact that it was one of those rare times where I, I end up saying that that having large groups. Of secondary of secondary characters who don't have any who 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 don't appear to have any purpose in the story, like all, all the no name characters, actually do have a purpose in the plot. Because the, the thing is, with with a fight like this, you you you, you, you I I think what, what what you end up really looking for is it, it's pretty much how it's pretty much how 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 much the fight ends up and ends up affecting everyone else. How, not necessarily how how it affects how it affects the people fighting, but how it affects. Everyone else, and in this, it throughout this entire fight of Endeavor versus 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 high versus high end, you, you pretty much see how you pretty much see how 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 the crowd is basically getting behind Endeavor that they're cheering him on that they're they're doing they're basically they're basically building him up as 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 this new as as this new as this new as this brand new as this brand new person who's who's decided hey. He's he's basically fighting for us. He 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 definitely deserves our support. So, yeah. In, in that sense, well, well, we can't say that the, the fight itself was, but itself was anything special. It was is basically how it was affecting everyone around them. I think is is what made this fight work overall. To be honest with you. And of course, the highlight of this chapter and the fight was obviously the panel of endeavor of endeavor mimicking All Might's pose after he defeated All for One with him just. Raising his raising his hand, going, I'm I'm number one, and well, well, we could definitely argue as, as to which fight is more epic. It really like the the with this fight ending, it pretty much cements a lot of things. Like the fir the first being a pass. Like the first thing is that it, it showcases a passing of the torch, and it cements that Endeavor has now officially come into his own as the new symbol of peace, and. Honestly, I'm really hoping we, we pretty much get to see we, we, we pretty much get to see the change in the mentality of heroes that Hawks wanted from the beginning of this arc because I I, I think I I, I want to like Horikoshi he, he I, I want to say that, that he, he he definitely isn't he isn't one who 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 is willing to just let let something let something just slide like this I I I think he is definitely going I think he is definitely going to show us exactly how, how the how this is gonna affect the, the hero society from for, for now on going forward, and like I said, I, I think I think it, I think it can re it can really only affect the hero society in the best ways possible. Like I I, de I definitely want to see how I definitely want to see how, how how Endeavor's victory here affects affects the mentality of uh, of every single every single pro hero now, because like I I can only assume that 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 those who are watching Endeavor fight. Even and win and winning even without All Might around, I think it showcases that yeah the, the heroes can get stronger and the heroes can in fact win. So the heroes can get stronger and they can in fact and they can in fact do and they can in fact do and they can in fact do things even if even if All Might isn't there. So yeah, um, and yeah, uh, and okay. I I'll and of course I I I can't I can't go without mentioning All Might's reaction. Like again, All Might's reaction, All Might's reaction to Endeavor's victory and using using his victory pose was just 
this is just pure comedic gold. Just just seeing that look of dumb, just seeing that dumb that one expression and how dumbfounded he was in that moment. Just like it it had me laughing. I'm not gonna lie. And like I said, it did. And like I said, it and and even though it was funny, it did basically reinforce that yeah that yeah. It, it it may have surprised all night, but but it definitely shows that th 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 that there is going to be a changing of the guard here. That there is going to be a changing of the guard here very soon. And yeah, I, like honestly, just 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 push the potential of 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 of, 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 how, of how powerful all, all of these hero of all these pro heroes getting stronger. That that of all these pro heroes getting stronger, like all all the heroes that, that are in class one A getting. Getting stronger is kind of it's kind of scary to be honest with you. Like I, I can't wait to see is, is what Hodokoshi is gonna is gonna do with with this whole this this whole thing of Endeavor being the new symbol of peace. Now it's it's actually kind of insane. Um, and all right, so Dobby makes his reappearance at the end of the chapter, and from the sounds of it, he's the one who released High End, which which okay, I I wonder if uh, which. Right off the bat, it makes me wonder if this was if this was Dobby working on his own, or if, or if he was releasing high end on 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 pretty much on on, on pretty much orders from on 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 some kind of orders from Sheik 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 Araki. Because I mean, I I know that Dobby kind of has his has his own views of, of what of what he wants to do as a villain, but I I I, I really. But part of me wonders if he just did this on his own, or if, or if he ended up doing it on, on, on doors from from from, from, his, from from the leader from the from the leader who who is who is Shigaraki. So, yeah, it makes me wonder. If, yeah, if he just did this on his own, and if he or if he or if he had orders. But in either case, um, wh wh whether or not he he did it on his own, or whether or not he did this whole thing on his own or not, it makes me wonder even more. What's What's basically going to happen from here? Like, what exactly does what exactly does Dobby what exactly does, does Dobby Dobby end, end up showing showing up in this last page mean? Because the, the the thing the thing about Dobby for sure is that out of all the League of Villains, he's the one with the largest mystique factor. And while there have been plenty of fan theories going around about his about him since he was introduced, Harakoshi himself hasn't really touched on or addressed. Any hasn't touched on or just in, in, any anything on Dobby or, or or any of the theories or any of the theories uh, I, pretty much about him to be true or not. So I I feel that I I I, I definitely think that the, I definitely feel that with 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 him reintroducing Dobby in this way that there is potential in order for Horikoshi to address a lot at least a good half of of, of the fan theories that have been made about Dobby. Although whether or not he actually does, I guess we'll just have to wait and see. I, I guess we'll just have to wait and see. Like, uh, like again, this, this, this is definitely. I, 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 I'm, I'm always open. To, like honestly, th there are times where actually I'm, I'm always open to, to definitely learning a lot more about the villains than I am about the heroes. And with Dobby, like he's, again, he's just such a mystery that that I want to know more about him. So I, I hope Horikoshi actually does take that chance. That does take this opportunity and actually expand a little more on on who Dobby is as a character. Although I'm, I do hope that this isn't gonna. I do hope that that, that whatever Dobby is doing here, part of me is hoping it doesn't erupt into another fight because both Hawks and Endeavor look look to be at their limit and look to be at their limit. So I, I don't think that, that that they're really even primed or ready to even even go into another fight. Um, and. As actually, as I'm talking about this, I realize that 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 something like that that a setup like this, it might kind of, it might kind of get the get the theories about whether or not this is where All Might dies or not. And to be honest, and and to be honest, like with, with what I mean is, but by, by pretty much All Might dying at the hands of Dobby by rushing out there to save Endeavor, or something if things go south. But to be honest. And 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 again, and 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 unless from a unless from a shake shake and and unless we end up seeing shake 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 Araki show up, I really can't see I really can't see that particular scenario right now because if 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 all my died at Dobby's hands, I it wouldn't really have any it wouldn't really have any emotional impact. I think like it would make more if 
if the prophecy that the prophecy that that pretty much if the prophecy if the prophecy that that pretty much that 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 if the prophecy of of night eyes of night eyes ended up becoming true, I don't think it would happen. But by, by some random villain, it would have to be someone who who, who pretty much all might knew or who or who who all might was acquainted with. So it's gonna be if you, you either shig 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 Iraqi or or all all for one is gonna escape and kill him. Like it's it has to be one of those two scenarios. It has to be it it can't be some just just random just random. Just random guy off the street, so yeah, or and especially not, and especially not an underling, a Shigaraki for sure. Um, so let's talk about Endeavor's family in this chapter, and actually this this whole arc, specifically Todoroki, because from reading this chapter, it actually occurred to me the sheer brilliance of what Horikoshi did did here in this in this chapter, because did here with this arc, and. If you look at it, despite the fact that Todoroki had absolutely zero, had had absolutely had absolutely pretty much zero involvement in the actual fight itself, he still received so much development from just watching his father fight high end, and it made him realize not only how much his father actually changed and became a true hero, but he also like pretty much pretty much throughout. Pretty much in Todoroki's journey, one of the themes I've noticed is is, is basically him, him developing respect for his father, him slowly but surely developing respect for his father. This was basically basically the final this was the final loop in in that in in that thing of him of his development of him respecting his father come full circle. Like he actually he he actually legitimately respects and like after this fight he has literally come full circle and started to respect and, and admire. Admire who who pretty much his who his his pretty much who who his who about about his lineage and and who his father is so yeah and he and um, remind you Horikoshi did all this without Todoroki even needing to fight that's that is kind of a feat I'm not gonna lie and in the case of Todoroki's siblings it came full circle with them when when they basically, like during this fight they were they were thinking of. You can just see on their faces they they were thinking the entire time about what their mother had told them about how much Endeavor has changed, and watching this fight gave them total clarity on on what she was talking about and what she meant. Like, yeah, so like everything. If anything, I, I feel that the biggest thing that this chapter achieved is that, is that it is that it came is that it achieved a, a full circle a full circle change for pretty much the, 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 all, 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 everyone in, in Todoroki's family almost. So, yeah, in that regard, I, I, I gotta get a props for that too. Um, but, yeah, guys, that's my review. If you enjoyed the video, like, comment, subscribe, follow me on Twitter and Facebook. Death Metavone, signing off. Later, guys.